And throw a giant sky penis. That would be awesome. Yeah, what you do with your fly? Oh, we turned dinosaurs into sky penises. <laughs> it's a great idea. We can do it. Yeah, I'm going to basically draw a figure eight and turn around and come back. I'm going to go down and grab some speed and hopefully get out of the contrail layer so they're not connected to uh, each other. <laughs> Dude, that would be so funny. It's like airliners coming back on the way into Seattle. Just, just this big fucking giant penis. We can almost draw a vein in the middle of it, too. Yeah, see it there, just kind of like pigtail it to the left, because you already got the split. Is that what you're doing, the split? Yeah, come back for speed. That's right, dude. Yeah, balls are going to be a little lopsided. That's it, all right. Okay, balls are complete. Got to navigate a little bit over here for the, uh, the shaft. And yeah, which way is the shaft going? The shaft will go to the left. It's going to be a wide shaft. Yeah, I don't want to make it just like three balls. It does, and the head of that penis is going to be thick. Man, I gotta say, that looks pretty good. You are a natural-born artist. Man, this is like the biggest penis I have ever seen. All the airliners are gonna be seeing that, yeah. If you like do a pass, make sure it's kind of scribbled out. <laughs> I mean, it's staying there quite a long time. It's not dissipating at all. Yeah, uh, it's got a good point. Um, okay, I guess I'll kind of go through a pass again. Hopefully it doesn't, uh, you know, make it look more uh, veiny than it, than it already is, but... Hey, well, I tell you, that's a great penis right there. That's a, that's a great penis. Make the Navy proud. <laughs> oh, damn. All right, here we go.